pre-recorded in Mr. Hall's spare bedroom, this is your morning news covering hard-hitting subjects such as puppies, teachers dressed up funny, teachers with their pets, cats on a roof, sports and games, and last but not least, really cute children. Good morning, Castleton Village School. These are your morning announcements with your host, Mr. Hall. Good morning, Castleton Village School. Happy Friday Eve. It is Thursday, April 30th, 2020, and these are your morning announcements. Let's start with our challenge from yesterday. We had a little dance challenge for you all. I said submit Submit three dances, and I'll, I'll, uh, I'll submit one of my own. I'm happy to report we had two submissions, so I'm off the hook. Here they are, though. Check these out. They're pretty great. All right, and a huge thank you to the CVS Science Department for providing us with both of our submissions for this morning. Um, so let's talk a little bit about challenges. First of all, new challenge today is this. Mr. D's dance video that you just watched, that pays tribute to one of my favorite movies. I'll give you a hint. This movie is a comedy, if you couldn't tell from the dance clip. Um, so, if you can figure out, or if you know, what movie Mr. DeFrancesco was paying tribute to, then send me an email with your guess, and all correct submissions will be dropped into the hat, so to speak. Uh, there is no hat. For the drawing, uh, the prize drawing, which is coming up tomorrow. Um, exciting stuff. So, we've got that new challenge today. Um, and you know what? I just decided here this morning. We're going to leave the dance submission um, competition open one more day. So we're at two, and if we get to three, I'll, I'll do a submission of my own on tomorrow's announcements. Um, also, don't forget about our riddle going this week, okay? That is remove the outside, cook the inside, eat the outside, throw away the inside. What am I talking about? Had some great guesses so far, and we will reveal our answer to that riddle tomorrow all correct guesses again are going to go in our prize drawing for tomorrow okay on to the weather i didn't even want to do this today it's rainy it's windy it's not looking great um i'm sorry about it but you know um looks like sunday is going to be absolutely beautiful so you know we continue to have nicer weather to look forward to um we do have a high um, that is going to get up into the high 50s today. So, you know, it's not going to be cold, but wind and rain, unfortunately, is uh, the story of the day today and weather. Um, no birthdays today, but we sure have a lot of holidays to talk about. It is Adopt a Shelter Pet Day. Um, it is Animal Advocacy Day. I think those kind of go hand in hand. Um, Bugs Bunny Day, National Bubble Tea Day. Have you ever had bubble tea? What'd you think of it? I don't think, I don't think I've ever had bubble tea. What's it like? Is it good? Do people like it? National Honesty Day. I like that one. Um, and National Raisin Day. It's also Poem in Your Pocket Day. Hmm. I don't know anything about poem in your pocket day. 
if Miss Crum or Miss Chansky's watching this morning, do, you, do you either of you know anything or anyone else? Does anyone know anything about poem in your pocket day? I hope someone does so they can tell me what that's all about. But lots of holidays today, lots to celebrate today on this rainy Friday Eve. And I'm going to leave you with a quote this morning. I hope everybody has a great day today. Keep up the good work as always. Um, here's the quote. This is from Muhammad Ali. Um, I know that all of you learned a little bit about Muhammad Ali in uh, Mrs. Alexander's class this year. Um, as you know, he was formerly known as Cassius Clay and has a pretty cool story. Uh, championship boxer. But I thought this quote was extremely relevant um, for what we're, we're all experiencing right now. So I wanted to share it with you. And again, we'll end on this. Have a wonderful day today. Muhammad Ali said, don't count the days, make the days count. Take care, everybody.